we study the effects of climate change in Mongolia. Mongolia is witnessing a really rapid increase in temperatures throughout their region of Central Asia. And uh, Mongolia is also very dependent on the land. Up to 30% of the country are still nomadic herders, meaning they move around from place to place with their herds of yak, sheep, and goat. And so any changes to the steppe ecosystem are really going to have a big effect on the country as a whole. Our biggest experiment is a climate manipulation study where we use passive warming chambers to warm the air and soil in that area. And we're looking at how the plant, microbial, and even the grazing community is reacting to this. Uh, because precipitation regimes are also going to change, we're doing a watering treatment as well to look at how these things will react to increased or decreased levels of water. Uh, one of our biggest studies is looking at how local nomadic pastoralists, well, what they think of climate change, what they think is changing and why they think it's changing. And this has been very helpful. They've given us a lot of good perceptions about what matters to them, what aspects of the ecosystem are important to them, and how up to 70% of them think the changes are happening because of climate change. Our field site is in a very, very remote area of northern Mongolia. Uh, it's, on, it's half steppe ecosystem and half forest ecosystem. And there we have five to six gares, or the traditional Mongolian tents, also known as yurts, set up. And we live in those. It's very rustic, no internet, no electricity, no cell phones, um, just a satellite phone to stay in contact with the rest of the world.